In Waco, a shocking discovery downtown. A concerned citizen called animal control after finding a bat laying on Austin Avenue. That bat sent down to Austin for further testing. Tonight, Fox 44's Anna Thrash joining us live in the control room with the results. Leslie, Robert, Animal Services told us that bat came back positive for rabies. And tonight we're wondering if that's cause for the community to be concerned. This is where someone found the rabid bat, the 600 block of Austin Avenue. Some might be worried about a possible health risk to the public, but not everyone. I don't have any concerns. I think you should just be aware of what you're picking up if you are being around it. Bats are part of the ecosystem. And Animal Control agrees, but does recommend caution. If you see a bat that concerns you, immediately call them and do not touch the animal. Uh, it is important not to pick them up with your bare hands because their teeth are so small that they can actually bite you without you knowing it. Luis Leva says bats are carriers for rabies, so many of them will test positive for the disease. He also says it is hard to tell if small animals like bats and skunks have rabies. Some animals like dogs will become more aggressive or clumsy and they will have hydrophobia. Uh, they start to fear water because they, uh, they're not able to swallow, so they start fearing water. Arnold says he thinks no one should worry. It's just part of living. You've got to share the planet with everything else. Leva says that if you think you came into contact with this rabbit bat, then you should contact your doctor and talk about getting post-exposure shots. Live in the control room, Anna Thrash, Fox 44 News.